If you've been looking for a way to have a little bit more fun with your form respondents, let me introduce you to the emoji slider for JotForm cards. Hey everyone, welcome to JotForm. I'm Kimberly and JotForm cards allows you as the user to have more dynamic design options. And with that comes the emoji slider. So let me show you how to use that. I'm gonna go up to create a form and I'm gonna start from scratch and I'm gonna choose the card format. Then just to get this started, I'm gonna come over to the left under add form element. I'm just gonna choose a couple basic form elements that most forms have. So I'm gonna choose a full name and an email. Then I'm gonna scroll down to the very bottom where it says survey elements and I'm going to choose the emoji slider. Now the great thing about this is we can have multiple sliders in the same card. So we can edit it here but I'm actually going to click on the properties the gear because it allows you to see so much more. So we can change the question right here. So then what did you think about and then under fields, the rows right down here, we can add different sliders. So let's say, what did you think about the venue? Then we can return it down and it adds a new slider for us. The food options, we'll tab down so we can get a new one. The music and the speakers. And then you can also see that we can make it an evaluation slider. We can make it the bubbles. We can do it yes or no. It can be check boxes. We can have it as drop downs, a text box. But you guys, what makes this fun is the emoji slider. So from here, we can either have it on a scale of five, which is going to automatically populate two. We can have it on a scale of three or we can have it on a scale of seven. So let's go up to publish. Let's open in a new tab and let's fill this out so we can see what it looks like in real life and then also with the submission. So I'm gonna go ahead and click start. And then submit. Perfect, all right, let's head back over to our dashboard and let's take a peek at these submissions. And there you go, and we can drag this out so we can see five out of seven, six out of seven, seven out of seven, we can see how people utilized our emoji slider. So I hope this helps. If you have any questions about utilizing the emoji slider in JotForm cards, please let us know and I'll see you next time.